Okay, darling. It's okay, sweetheart. It's okay, darling. Just for a short time. You come and say hello to the camera. Now, this is a very clever hen who goes broody and she's prepared to go without food and water and exercise and to sit just on her nest for up to 28 days, I think it's possibly 23 days, sitting on her egg. And she has a special uh, blood vessels here on her chest which swell up to keep the egg warm. And who, which came first, the chicken or the egg? It had to be the chicken because the egg needs warmth and it needs the warmth from the hen's breast here. Here's another hen. This one is not broody. And um, as the cockerel has to have uh, mated with, with a hen beforehand, otherwise the eggs would not be fertile. The eggs, amazing, they have a shell and the shell has tiny, tiny holes in it so that the air can get in and out. And inside the shell is a membrane which protects both the chick in the egg and also the shell. And then the chick, which I think is the most amazing thing of all, is slung on a hammock which goes from one end of the shell to the other so that when the egg is turned, it never, the, the, the developing chick never sticks to the, egg, to the inside of the shell. It is slung in a hammock across the middle. And in the egg are also um, a sack for food and a sack uh, which takes away waste and I think there's some water as well. So the whole thing is pre-planned and it all had to work and it all had to be there first time otherwise we ha wouldn't have any hens or any chicks.